Uh oh. What is up, Booby Goaters? My name is Erin, and welcome to Booby Goats. I was at Walmart, and you know what I picked up? Something fun. Mackerel and olive oil with lemon. Is it essence or just with lemon? With lemon. How awesome is that? So we're gonna bust into this guy and, and try him. Cause that's what I like to do. I like to try some different canned fish that I haven't tried yet. So let's bust open some King O. And now with some King Oscar Royal Filets mackerel in olive oil with lemon opening action. That was a lot to say. Here we go. Woo! Look at that. That boy's big. What do we say? That boy is thick. Nice and lemony. All right, let's uh, plate this guy up. Let's plate this up. Okay. Contains 3,300 milligrams of omega-3 fatty acids per serving. Get that omega-3 in that. Oh boy. All right, booby goaters. I'm gonna try this. There's no actual lemons in it. I'm just gonna dip this into the essence and taste. Oh, that is lemony. You can definitely taste it. Oh boy. It's like sour. For me it's sour and it's only sour for me because for the past two weeks I was on a lion diet challenge. If you don't know what a lion diet is, it's just salt water and beef. Ruminant animals. And everything I taste from, from henceforth is very powerful kind of strong and um, the lemon is very tart for me but it is so good though like mackerel itself I love mackerel it's delicious oh man yeah I like this I'm getting there with the flavor and the oil sorry for the shakiness the cat has arrived but look at that dripping that lovely lemony oil but it's a good flavor like the flavor it's so good. I like this. I'm going to start a sardine challenge and I'm not going to stop until I run out of sardines. And uh, I thought I'd do the mackerel first because it's not a sardine, it's a mackerel. And um, so be on the lookout for my sardine challenge videos. Oh, I got a key. Hold on. Hey, brother. Said Loki. He wants us some mackerel. There you go, buddy. Enjoy. Because I am enjoying just as much as you are. This King Oscars is the best. I reviewed them and they actually found me and was like, thank you for your wonderful review. And I was like, King O, that's awesome of you. Oh. And the carnivore baby has brought me my burger patties. So if you didn't know, I got a bunch of like huge tubes of beef at the GFS discounted for $20 a tube. And I thought that was a great deal because it's usually like $40 to $60. And I take my burger patties, my tube of burger meat, I shape them into patties and I put them on a tray. I freeze them and then I put them in a bag. So my little hockey pucks. I didn't count to see how many I made. I think I made like 12. Keep the toddler busy while I'm doing this video. She's digging through my freezer and bringing me things. I'm feeding them more. Here, go buddy. This is good. King O's mackerel. You get so much in the can and it's so delicious. I like. Mm. I forget how much I paid for the macro, but I'm sure it was under $3 for sure. I got them at Walmart. <laughs> yeah, this was a Walmart. All right, well, I would eat all these bits because I'm actually hungry, but I love my kitty cat, so here you go, Loki. There you go, Loki. Oh man, I wish I bought two cans of that. That was really, really delicious. It was a little tart in the beginning, but through the middle of it, I like it. I like it a lot. 
Well, have a great day, booby goaters. Rocky, can you put the burger patties back? Thank you. There you go. They go in the freezer, sweets. Thank you. Oop. There you are. Thank you very much. Bye-bye. Very good. What a precious angel you are.